What's happening, y'all? Well, this is part two of the painting. I already got most of it taped up. So this is the taped up. As you see, I leave a little gap. So that'll be a new edge on it. I hope I'm doing this right. But, you know, that's a new edge. So I leave a little gap. Just showing you more or less how I do it. Probably other people do it different. But for those that are first timers like me doing this stuff, this is how I do it. So I leave, remember, I leave this little gap everywhere. So I get a nice clean edge. So that's how it's looking. All right, I'm gonna start painting. I'm gonna start with the burgundy. This is, uh, it looks red, the paint that I have, but it's, it's like a burgundy and it matches, they have these little awnings here and it's the color that I'm painting, the burgundy. So it matches that, so. Kind of looks red on camera, but it's not. <clears throat> and this is the other side. Yeah, I use a lot of tape. But that's how it looks like. All right, guys, I'm going to start with the painting. Talk to you on a little bit. So, guys, I was asked what materials do I use? Well, this is what I'm using. I'm using cabinet rollers with the small cabinet uh, roller thing. I use the uh, skinny tape for my edges for for these edges. Then I use the fat tape go up so when I paint you know um almost I like Rust-Oleum paint but the uh, owners had this ace they bought this ace paint which is okay as long as it's enamel it has to be enamel paint these these are the my uh these uh, plastic razor blades to uh, clean your edges and stuff and scrape whatever sticking out from the decals. And, uh, and that's it, man. That's all I use. Little small minor stuff. I have paper here in case. Um, I have this. I have a uh, Big green case, I can spill some paint. And that's that's all I use, guys. I don't use paint brushes. Um, because they all leave a different texture. It's not the same as a roller or a paintbrush leaves they leave two different textures. So I try to avoid a paintbrush. And that's it, and plenty of tape. You know, plenty of tape. Plenty of tape. So that's what I use. So I'm going to show you how I paint in a few.